We're shaking y'all. It's your boy Star Game Bino. You already know the fuck going on here with DME TV. You already got time. Let's just get it. Gambino, what's going on, man? Cooling, man. How you? Good, man. Finally got you in the black couch. Yeah. I'm trying to chase, you know, chase you down for about <laughs> a couple of weeks. You know what I'm saying? Nah, man. We about to get it in. You know what I'm saying? I know you have. We got the boy about at least two interviews with DME TV right now. Yes, sir. But you got it with, you know what I'm saying, him. We about to do our thing. You know what I'm saying? Let's stop for the people. Yeah, right, man. Tell me, you just drop a project, man. Yeah, What's man. Up? A little album tape called um, Great G R V I I I. You know what I'm saying? Just uh, you know, I call it an album tape because I use some industry beats that was already out. You feel okay. me? And then some shit that I damn picked up on along the way. Okay. You know. Okay. What's up with that title, though, man? Uh, What's up with that title? great, man. Just you know, I just feel great in the moment as far as like music go and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? So I just feel like. I ain't had no choice but to name it that, you know. I was just going through my mind on what I could name it and stuff. And it's like my third big project within like one year, you know. So I just felt great in the moment. And I spelt it like that because, you know, people do that little symbol shit with the GR8 with the number 8. So I just used the Roman numeral. Okay. It'd be something different, you know. Okay. Tell, tell the people, you know what I'm saying, a, a little bit about that album, like, like the inspiration of like maybe your favorite song. Uh, on, on the album. it just more or less like people say I don't really like you know talk about my mindset. Most of my music be like fun party music or whatever like that, or like music for females. So I just kind of like delve into like what I be thinking about, you know, and just give them a little take on like how I feel for real, you know what I'm saying, where my mind be at and everything like that. So, but I still made it like vibey, you know what I'm saying, yeah. where it wasn't just like. Oh, just hard rap, yeah. you know. I mean, your music catchy, man. It's dope, and it got a different sound, a different vibe. I know you had one kind of like a, uh, I don't know, it was a reggae inspired type track. Yeah. But that joint's like it's, it's different because a lot of people don't you know a lot of artists they don't do that anymore. They used to do a lot in the nineties, you know. So when right. I heard, I was like, damn, this is what I'm talking about. This is like how you supposed to make music, man. So. Right. What's, what's the name of that? What's the name of that track? Uh, you talking about Bad Girl? Bad Girl. That's off my um last album, right, um Stargazing. Yeah, okay. I dropped that like probably like six months ago or something like okay. that. Yeah. How that one been doing, man? How, how that, that? Oh, I mean, yeah, that been, been doing that been doing pretty good, man. Um, you know, it doing better than like any other project I did, like uh, Love Money Culture again, being on live statistics. It did better than all of them and stuff like that. So, okay. I, I, I'm really proud of that one, okay. that, um Stargazing. So what else you got going on for 2019, man? Like, what's some goals you got set and what moves you gonna make um, this year? I plan on uh, doing another little tour, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to, okay. uh, throughout the rest of this year, starting probably like in the summertime, you know? Okay. Um, probably gonna re just release some singles and stuff like that, you know, just some okay. fun party music and just on whatever kind of essence that the, I feel like my environment is, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna be doing that. And uh, do some videos, a bunch of videos with y'all, you know. Okay. Keep working like that and um, try and pick up the pace around South Carolina because I be trying to stretch out way far, far, far out in like way different cities, like out of state and stuff like that. But I'm going to try and like get my name bigger in yeah. the state that I live in this yeah. year. So Definitely. Yeah. Like what, uh, what's, what cities outside of your city showing love? Uh, I say like Columbia. I got a couple people in Charleston right with me, you know. Um, Greenville okay. as well, like most of my plays from South Carolina yeah. come from, you know what okay. I'm saying? Um, and like, uh, it's a place called, um, I forget what a place called, it's up there by Clemson. They be showing me love, like mm -hmm. that area and stuff like that, like the 864 region yeah. pretty much. 864, okay. Yeah. okay. Yeah. You just open a business, right? You got a, you got yeah, okay. yeah, a little boat that's dope, you know what I'm saying? You're yeah. your entrepreneurship. You yeah, know what I'm um, I got a little charter build, boat business type okay. thing, you know what I'm saying? Okay. I just take people out to the island and stuff like that, you know? Yeah. So, just do a little something like that. One of the first black businesses in on Front, front Street, Street. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Like we don't know about George Sanson. Like yeah, the things we go through. Right, you know and the history so of that whole area and everything talk about like that. that man. Yeah, I'm um, the youngest black uh, business owner okay. on Front Street, you know? So. Okay. That's something. Be a great thing, dog. Yeah, they're gonna put me on um some I forgot what they were calling it, you know, I ain't really paying no attention because I ain't been I don't really like dab into that yeah. side of the town, you know what I'm saying? So yeah. Um, yeah. yeah. So what else you got for the people, man? I know you, you got you you up here in Columbia, you got something going on today, but 
Um, you got anything like in the next week or two that you probably gonna be at performing? In the uh, shows? I'm gonna be doing. I'm gonna probably be at like Monet's Taste Lounge. I'm um, trying to come up here again. Probably like I gotta do a show tonight up here. Um, and I'm gonna try to come back up here like next weekend, you know, do a couple of spots around here, you know, try and get my name out there a little bit yeah. more. Cause I feel like, you know, Charleston and Columbia, that's like the two biggest cities in South Carolina. You right. get your name wrong, Ron, they, if they rock with you, you know what I'm saying? They gonna rock with you and then, you yeah. know, it could be bigger. And it, just this area, you know what I'm saying? And yeah. same thing with up here, you know. Definitely. I want to touch on uh, your movement, man. SDS, man. Let's, let's talk about who's SDS and, and, and what we can figure out. What, what, what's, what's new? What's coming out? Uh, SDS, we the mob, you know, the Smoking Dope Squad's a group we got. Me, Lasky Bands, Gunna Going Cap, uh, Matt Got Money, uh, Miss Got Plugs, you know what I'm saying? We all just pretty much a coagulated group of talented people, you know what I'm saying? And my boy Lasky Bands just dropped a um, mixtape. Uh, you can get that on all like mixtape sites, spinrealadaptpiff.com. Just type in lots, get bands. He got a bunch of material out there right now. Right. Um, I also got Gambino Family, the label I just started. Okay. Um, I just signed two artists, one J5 and um, one Crown Juvie. And uh, I'm, J5 got his project out. I already got his um, project out, Fire Life, F I L I F E. You know what I'm saying? I got his project out on all streaming sites right now. Okay. Um, we're getting ready to drop Crown Juvie, and I'm trying to. You know, find some more artists that I could probably like bring to my label and stuff. Cause it's gonna come a time where like it might be too late for me if I don't get on. You feel me? Yeah. And I just know the business of it now, so yeah. I can just like instill that on you know other people and stuff without ripping them off. Or, yeah. You know definitely. what I'm saying? Cause people would do that to you these days, man. Hell yeah. They definitely get you. Shit. Hell yeah. So man, go ahead and drop that social media info for all the people, man, so they can check out your music, keep up with you. You know what I'm saying? See, see what you got going on. Oh yeah, man. I'm uh, on Instagram, the Real Star Gambino. Uh, Facebook at the Real Star Gambino or Star Gambino. Twitter Star underscore Gambino. Snapchat Star Gambino zero five zero. I'm on Google Plus. I'm on every musical platform. Just typing Star Gambino on Google, and then wherever you get your music from, I'm on there. I promise you that. Um, just check me out, man. I got three albums out, two mixtapes out, man. You know, I got uh, all kind of vibes and stuff like that. And uh, make sure y'all check out my new project, Great, on all digital platforms right now. And Best Buy. Word. And Best Buy. Hey, man, appreciate you coming through. You already appreciate know me, bro. Down. You already know me, bro. All right, peace. Whoop.